I recently purchased this Ryobi uh, Bluetooth speaker and uh, it was shipped to me just like this. It was thrown into a box and when it got here, besides you know being used, it is actually broken. Um, one of the speakers doesn't work and the other one fades in and out. So rather than just throw it away or return it or something, I actually bought new speakers for it. And I'll show you how you can go about replacing the speakers because uh, I got this one for pretty cheap and the speakers weren't expensive. So I figured rather than throw it away, I might as well fix it. The model number for this is the Pad 01. And um, it's actually pretty easy to do. You just need a soldering iron. So the first step, you will need a screwdriver with a pretty small bit and you will unscrew these four screws. After you've unscrewed it, grab yourself a screwdriver or you can use plastic pry tools uh, if yours isn't scratched up like mine is. And you just jam it right over here. Again, I'm doing this one-handed so you can take your time and hold the speaker so you don't mar up your speaker. But once you separate it, there's a few places that it clips in and then you can pull it out. No. The next step after that is there's a, a few screws around here that you need to take off to take this faceplate off. The speakers have some screws, but I wouldn't worry about them now until you get the wires soldered off and then you can worry about putting new speakers in there. So now that You've removed the screws. Here's what the the inside of the speaker looks like. You can unplug this connector right here. This just goes to the battery. Okay, the two parts are separated. And uh, we can actually see on my speakers, the magnet actually separated from the coil here. And this magnet is on its way out. So either it was damaged in shipping or the the person threw the speaker around who owned it before me. So we'll be replacing this speaker completely. Well, both of them. Next thing we need to do is grab our soldering iron and remove these two speaker connectors. And then we'll be adapting our own in there and then soldering them back up. Here's the abused uh, speaker, and then here is the new one that I bought. So it just dawned on me that this is only 10 watts, and this is 15, but for me it doesn't matter. Uh, better than one speaker working. And luckily, uh, I didn't plan this at all, but maybe all the speakers from China that are 3 inch, the holes line up for the most part. I might have to drill them bigger if they don't work. Okay, I've got the two speakers screwed in. Behind me, I've got them wired in. I've put uh, this control box back in because I did take it out to make it easier to solder. I've plugged them back in like they should be. And now you just have to follow the instructions backwards. So you put that big case on and then that and you're, you're all set to go. It's nothing hard at all, so. So here's how the speakers sound like broken.
content, ain't trying to be complacent. Waking up, it's just me, what's new? Sun is shining, but the pain. Lost into trying, we've lost into trying. Trying to be content, ain't trying to be complacent. Trying to stay grounded while I'm trying to break it. Now that's how it should sound instead of the one speaker barely working because you know it was blown up. The second one messed up. So that's how it should be. Power off. Yeah. So if you guys have blown speakers or uh, yours aren't sounding as loud as they want, this is only a 10 watt speaker. So I'm guessing these 15 watt ones were just some really cheap Chinese ones. Um, because they didn't get loud at all. Well, granted, mine's broken. And this is, you know, I bought it. Never had one before. So, maybe it got louder with the 15-watt 6-ohm uh, speakers. These are 4 or I believe they're ohms. Anyways, yeah, hope this helps you guys replace some of your speakers. Or maybe even troubleshoot it. If you've got issues with one speaker not working, take it apart. It's super easy. Four screws on the front, six screws on the bottom comes apart and like you're looking at three minutes to do it if you take your time so yeah hope this helps and see you guys in the next one